Hello and welcome. Today we're going to install the 12th upgrade here in the 23 Model Y Long Range. You know, this is an awesome vehicle. I've upgraded it. It's really a neat vehicle. However, it was lacking one thing that I really couldn't quite figure out until I received an advertisement in the email. I looked around and looked at all my options and decided to order something from Amazon to, I think, solve the problem. So what is the problem? Here. You look here in the door. It's really nice. You open it up. I've got this cool tray here of stuff. That's an upgrade. But where's the USB? Well, these are inductive chargers, perfect for the phone. But what if you have a different kind of phone that either doesn't have inductive charging? Yeah, yeah, I know. And if not, if you need a wire, what do you do? Well, located conveniently here, as you see, one and two USB-Cs. They're great down there, but I'd have to plug a wire on there and drape it up. And then when I close this, what happens is the wire, it sticks out of here. That sucks. So how do I deal with it? This is how you deal with it. I bought this located here in uh, Amazon and uh, it's uh, an upgrade for the Tesla Model 3 and Model Y of 22 and 23. Why? Because of this open door here. The older uh, models, like my 2020, has a black piano black thing. It's uh, not compatible with this. Let's have a look at this thing. I got the top open on it. Get this out of here. It's pretty well packed. Yeah, what do we got here? I have an insert that inserts right in that drawer opening. And what's on it? On this side is a USB-C. This side is a lightning connector. I have a 3 amp USB-C on the right side of the logo. And on the left side, I have a USB-A, also 2.4 amps. Plenty of power. But how does it connect to the car? Well, looky there. Two USB-Cs here plug directly into the car. So how in the heck would I install something like this? Let's have a look. This is going to be fun. I'm holding the camera with one hand and I'm going to install it with my left hand. So how do you go about installing it? Well, I think the procedure is pretty straightforward. You take the charge adapter and you put it into the rail that this slides on, okay? I just pull it like that. I push it like that. And then I plug in the two USB-Cs. Now I may need a couple hands for this. I'm looking through the camera viewfinder. I know it's here somewhere, hold on. I'm doing it using the braille method here. Come on. I know it's there, it must be up higher. There it is, just like that. Okay, let's see if we can get this second one in here. This is probably one of the fastest upgrades I've ever done. Bam, and what lights up? The Tesla logo. That's it, now watch this, this is the cool part. Dang, isn't that sweet? Look at that, matches the cover. Of course, the cover is uh, uh, almost the exact same as this. This is slightly different, but it's uh, pretty darn close. So what do we have? Well, you remove the little sticker bob here and you take your USB-C and you pull on it. And look at that, it's retractable. Why? Because then I can plug it into whatever device I have. You pull it and let it go. And where does it go? It retracts right back. And it lays over so you can put whatever on top. This uh, little protective film on top of the logo. I'll leave it there for now. 
the lightning connector is the same. It pulls out and you can actually hook up multiple devices at one time. So that is a sweet upgrade here for the Model 3 and Model Y of 2022 and 2023. And I suspect 2024s will also have the same. Well, there you have it, a live shot. I installed it with my left hand, you watched, I looked at it, wham, bam, and it was done. It's that simple to install a port extender in your Tesla Model Y or 3 2022 or 2023s, possibly 2024s. If you like today's video, give me a like, and if you would, please subscribe if you're not already a subscriber, and please pass it on to your friends. They might like to subscribe as well. If you're currently not a Tesla owner, the referral link shown here at the bottom of the screen will get you a discount in buying your own Tesla and also give you the use of full self-driving for three months. And if you take delivery in 23, you get six months of free supercharging. That means you can go on trips, charge for free as much as you want for six months. It's really quite the deal. If you liked today's video, give me a like. Thank you for watching. I'll look for you in the next video and take care.